Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. On this channel, you'll find financial, travel, and more videos just like the one you're watching right now. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today, I'll have another episode of unboxing video, and I'll be unboxing a LED desk lamp, which is the Holan Smart Touch LED desk lamp. Now. This is uh, not a paid or affiliated review. I purchased this product with my own money and uh, there is no affiliated or paid link. So what, what you're going to hear is uh, what uh, is honest and uh, unbiased opinion. So this uh, LED desk lamp was something I needed for my laptop or for my workstation. And the one old one I have is uh, I've been using it for about 10 years or more so it doesn't work anymore that well so hopefully this is the product uh, I've been looking for and it will work now before I do that uh, let's take a look at some of the specs so this is uh, 0.75 uh, voltage ampere and uh, DC 12 volt and uh, this one has actually one uh, 1.5 uh, meter cable and power is 8 watt so the color temperature it can be adjusted from 27,000 K to 65,000 K uh, and this should be done just uh, by touching the base of the desktop so let's start the unboxing and then we'll go through some more specs later on and uh, in the second part of this video I'll put this uh, desktop uh, desk lamp on my desk and then I'll show you how it works at night uh, this is uh, daytime right now so right now I'll just do the unboxing and later on I'll do the testing which will uh, I'll add it to the uh, video uh, later on so let's start with the unboxing so here the box and uh, they mentioned some features right here for example it has one hour auto timer uh, touch dimming uh, CCT adjustable, I'm not sure what does that mean, double memory, rotable lamp arm, and eye protection. Okay, so we'll open it from this side. Okay, so once you open the cover of the box, uh, it looks like this, and it looks like uh, they have attached a small brochure or user manual and it has different five different languages so i'm not going to go through all the specs again here or everything here so this is a handy thing to have uh, it's only let me see one two three four four pages of english instructions so i just set this aside here and then if i remove this uh, from the box which is kind of the protector or giving protection of the lamp so let's take a look okay so it looks like i should be able to remove this lamp from here uh, i have uh, an attachment it looks like a cable i'll set it aside and look at it later so let's uh, get rid of the lamp first Okay, so I took out the lamp, I'll set it aside here and I'll put the box away. Okay, so let's keep the box there. And so here's the full lamp, it's wrapped and I'll remove it from the uh, wrapping paper. So, okay, so let's put it there. So, okay, here's the lamp uh, right here, and looks like this is the base, and this is the head. And you can see that the LED is right here. So, let's uh, put it on the base here, and if I flip it up, then Okay, so we have the lamp here, 
and actually this one rotates I can see this one rotates and the arm which rotates as well and okay so I have a feeling that okay so you can see a little bit here I don't have enough space so okay so what it looks like to me that right here this is where is the LED and once it's on the light is going to come out through this section and then you can actually uh, flip it up or down uh, and adjust the length adjust the position actually and then you can also at the same time adjust the arm and then we have the power cable here so which will go to the power outlet right here and then this will go inside the lamp and then here we can see the power button and there are various uh, buttons uh, one I can see is the one hour uh, timer and these two I do not know but looks like they are like in a power up and down so we'll look at these everything when we uh, connect it to a power outlet and I put it on my desktop so the unboxing portion is done right here so the next part I'll just wait till it gets dark and then I'll attach it to the video thank you hello everyone so this is the second part of the hello LED desk lamp review so I'm looking at uh, we're looking at uh, my workstation and uh, there's no uh, light uh, on at this point so this is my old light uh, which kind of uh, gave up working it still works but the switch is uh, really tight and it's very I have difficulty turning it on and off so I set up the LED light which is right here and I'm going to just uh, go through uh, how it works and show you some uh, of the buttons so the first thing uh, here uh, that we're going to we're going to turn on the power button which is on the very left so I'll just touch it okay so I touched it and it is on and as you can see uh, so the power button actually uh, whenever you are setting uh, you are uh, going up or down on the light or you are making it cool uh, white or warm white light so if you turn it off it just saves the last setting so the moment i turned it on it's just giving me the setting which i set up before so let's uh, take a look at the uh, how bright it can go so this is the lowest uh, setting so this is the least uh, bright uh, the light is so i'll just put it uh, keep touching it until it gets brighter okay so as you can see uh, this is actually extremely bright right now and this is uh, this is the maximum so I'll just go back a little far and I'll show you that how bright it is so this is very bright uh, camera is not uh, catching it properly but you can uh, see by looking at the light underneath the, just on the base so we'll uh, just uh, lower it a little bit so I'm going to just uh, lower a little bit now I'm going to show you the color temperature button which is right uh, here so if I press it uh, right now it's cool white and it's going to turn into warm white okay so as you can see it's turning kind of yellow or yellowish so this is uh, warm white and let me just uh, move backward a little bit and as you can see that it's a little bit uh, it's kind of yellowish color which is warm color and let me see if it goes down further okay no actually it's coming uh, okay let me see yes so I think this is the maximum yellow uh, or warm color you can go and let me just uh, change it to cool white so okay so right now it is cool white so I like uh, cool white more than uh, warm white uh, because uh, it gives like you know the cool white color is actually kind of mimics the daylight and the warm white colors is uh, kind of a warm uh, color so I prefer the cool white and uh, then there's a uh, one hour button right here so I'm not going to press that because if you press it then it will turn off just after one hour so which is a good feature to have but most likely I'm not going to use it that much now let's try to bend the arm 
So let's say I'm holding on to it, then I can bend it uh, this way or any way I want, and then you know it can is going to like not the uh, space that you are bending it. In. So let me just put it back here, and then uh, there's another uh, you can bend, you can bend or move the head uh, uh, as well. So you can just uh, do it this way if you want light on your let's say uh, laptop or on your on a specific uh, location so you can just you know uh, move it backward or forward and that way it will give you uh, light uh, where exactly you want and let me just uh, put it upward to see how far it can go okay so it looks like this is the maximum point upward it can go it's not going back any further so then it comes back up to this point so that's mainly it so this is going to be about 9 watt electricity cost it's uh, uh, the connection is actually it's not uh, it's like a 3.5 millimeter connection it's not but it's, it looks like that so it's just like you know the way you uh, charge your uh, you power your cell phone uh, or your laptop so it's just a pin uh, kind of connection uh, which is right here and 9 watt of electricity cost which is not bad at all so uh, the build of the product looks very good it doesn't look cheap uh, it looks very high quality and it's, I believe it's aluminium here because it feels cold to touch and maybe plastic no actually it looks like this one is aluminium or it could be high quality plastic but the base is definitely aluminium this one is aluminium so that's it for this desk light uh, uh, so far I have nothing to complain about uh, this product uh, cost approximately 25 to 30 dollars Canadian so this is not an expensive product at all a uh, very good price pro product and the way uh, it's made it looks like you know very good quality and good uh, product uh, and again, this is not a paid or affiliated review, so I'm just telling you what I think it is. And I hope that uh, it lasts uh, years. So, uh, by the looks of it, it looks everything okay. But you know, if it doesn't work after uh, two weeks or two months, then uh, definitely it's not a good product. But hopefully, it will last for many years. So, if you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. And there will be more videos coming up. I'll see you shortly. Thank you.